good evening parents uh, this video shows how to log into e-learning platform we shared the login details the username and the password for every child uh, you start by opening google you you come and open google open google then under search under search we are looking at this here you type saint francis buddha dot com saint francis buddha dot com words are in small letters no space then if even after writing dot com don't leave space so after writing saint francis buddha dot com you are going to press search or go some phones have search others they have go so let me press go when you press go you will be able to see the interface with the badge and course categories under course categories you have classes p1 to p7 then baby middle and top class it's up there or down here we have login you can use any you can use the one up or you can use the one down so when you press login now we are going to put the username and the password <coughs> let me use an example of nanyonja shanta nanyonja Nanyonja six dot shanta is the example I'm using as the username. The username should be in small letters and there is a full stop or a dot in between the two names then the password the password should start with the capital letter capital letter So after putting the username and the password, you are going to press login. But before pressing login, uh, if the phone you are using to login for the first time is the phone you are going to be using to access this learning platform, you can press this box here remember username so the username will automatically be inserted every time you open uh saint francis with the e-learning platform so when you press login it will bring a notification that save password you can either save the password or you can leave it but it's better if you are going to be using the same phone to click save password or if you are trying this out on a different phone you can press never so after 
you are going to see subjects. I have used the login details for physics. I'm seeing English, mathematics, science, and social studies. So, if you can see this, it means you have logged in successfully. Now, to make login, to make an easy login, up here we have three dots. Up here we have three dots. You tap on those three dots. Then you'll see add to home screen. So you are going to press at home screen. Then it will bring at home screen. Then dashboard. You can rename that word dashboard. You can remove this dashboard and put any other name. For example, when I remove dashboard, I can put St. Francis. Can use calculators. St. Francis e learning. Then after that, I'll press on add. Then again, you press, you press add. So let's just go back to the home screen. You can see the home screen. We have now something like an application or a shortcut having St. Francis. So, you just tap on it. It will take you direct to the e-learning without putting login details again. So now, this is the e-learning platform. Currently, there are no lessons or recordings apart from the past papers we uploaded. When you click on Primary 6 Mathematics, so if it brings something like this, uh, New activity information, you can just press end tour. You can just press end tour. The notification will go so, away. Now, under mathematics, we have past papers. And a folder here, past papers. So you can press on past papers. So you can see, again, this word end just press enter or you press this here for it to go away so you can see the different past papers we uploaded these past papers we have for last year i think so for now this is a video which displays how you can log in into the system.